Hey everyone, welcome to Cook With Me. Today's video is a buy and try, and today I am going to be cooking up this linguine with clam sauce from Trader Joe's. I don't go to Trader Joe's too often because it's too far from us, but I picked this up, I wanted to try it, so let's get cooking. The instructions on the packet say to place two tablespoons of water and frozen linguine in a skillet. Cover and cook on high heat. So I'm gonna turn this on high, and I'm gonna put two tablespoons I have water in. One, two, that's hot. I just heated it up in my kettle before putting it in. Cut this open. I'm gonna just pour this in. I'm gonna just separate these pasta nests from each other and just have that there. I don't have a lid for this pan, so I'm just gonna use this pizza pan I have put it right on top. I'm going to set my timer so that in two minutes I'm going to turn the nests over. It's been two minutes. I'm going to lift this up. Now I'm going to flip the nest over. Okay, so we're going to turn the heat down. And we're going to give us a little bit of a stir. These two are still a bit frozen. Stir these other ones. Mix it all up. And I'm going to cover it again. This time it says to cover it and cook on lower heat for four to five minutes. It's been a few minutes. I'm going to give this another stir. It feels like most of the pasta is cooked. So I'm just going to let this go one more minute and then I'm going to plate it up. I'm going to sprinkle some of the clams on top. I'm going to sprinkle some fresh parsley on top. It adds flavor, it adds color. So here it is. You know how much I love eating on camera, but for the sake of you guys, I'll do it. Here, see if you can see it close up. Oh, guess. All right, guys, here we go. All right, so my first thoughts, it's got a little bit of a fishy taste, which I mean, has clams it's expected I don't think that there's enough clams in here I could probably make this cheaper at home and put more clams in it it's not practical for a family we're a family of six I would have to buy like four or five bags of this and I think it was $3.99 a bag so for my parents it's perfect because it's enough for them but for my family it's not I also feel like it needs some cheese on top because everything's better with cheese. My overall thoughts are it's good, but I don't think that I would buy it again. Thanks so much for watching. I look forward to the next video. Bye.